Hi roadies, this is Caroline with Maya Road. I'm here today to show you some of our new uh, freebies that we have just for our Maya Road friends. Um, these are some of our printable holiday uh, bottle cap papers. And here's some of the projects we're going to be doing today. Here's one of our three inch bottle caps made into a nice little ornament. And we're also going to be making a little two inch bottle cap one that has a cool uh, glittered snowflake in it. So let's get started. So let's start with our printed sheets. As you can see, each of the bottle caps, uh, the four inch, the three inch, and the two inch, they are um, sized to fit on each of their own separate sheets. And when you print them out, make sure you do not uh, select fit to page. You want to print them at full size so they'll fit the bottle caps. After you print each one out, as you, um, you'll also see that uh, each sheet has a bunch of different, uh, image, the same image on the same piece of paper so that you can decorate a lot of bottle caps of the same size at once. We'll kind of go here so you can see the bottle caps. What you'll do is you're going to want to go ahead and cut out the images that you had and you'll just apply a little bit of glue here you can just pop them directly into each of the bottle caps. So there's a 4 inch, there's a 3 inch, and there's a 2 inch one. And you'll just want to glue them down. And you'll see these are some of our decorated bottle caps that we've done and we're going to do a little bit more with these and show you how to make these bottle caps starting now. So we're going to go ahead and start with this snowflake one here which is our wooden snowflake that's decorated with some glitter glue and then put into a two inch bottle cap so you can make a beautiful ornament or magnet with it. And then we'll follow up by doing a three inch bottle cap and I'll show you how to make this cute little tree ornament to go into that. So let's get started. So these are the supplies you're going to need to make this little snowflake bottle cap right here. So as we talked about a little bit earlier, go ahead and cut out your two inch bottle cap printout, apply some adhesive on the back, and go ahead and put it inside your bottle cap. See how easy that is? Now you're going to want to set this aside, and now what we're going to do is we're going to decorate these two snowflakes. So I have here some two of our vintage wooden snowflakes, a small one and a larger one. And what I do first, is because I wanted to give it a bit of a white, is I'm going to use one of our bright metallic silver uh, ink pads, and I'm going to ink the entire snowflake. It'll give it a nice shine and a bit of shimmer. And it'll be easier to see when you see it in person. And after I've done that, what I'm going to do is apply some of these uh, diamond stickles glitter glue onto the snowflakes. And I basically am just outlining the entire snowflake both the top and the bottom with the glitter glue. It's going to take probably at least an hour or so to dry, but I'm going to actually use the glitter glue as an adhesive also. So I'm going to go ahead and glitter both the top and the bottom snowflake. And I'm going to put a little bit more of the glitter glue in the center of the bottom larger snowflake, as you can see here. And I'm just going to set smaller one on top of it. Just like that. Now, you can either let it dry here now, or you can go ahead, if you're careful, and finish off your snowflake by getting some of these foam dots, putting one piece right in the center of your two inch bottle cap, and going ahead and carefully lifting your snowflake that had the glitter glue on and setting it in there. And as you can see, you can let it dry like that, um, or give it an hour or two for it to dry, and you'll have a finished two inch bottle cap snowflake. And now we're going to make this three inch Christmas tree bottle cap ornament. So to start, you're going to go ahead and take your printouts and cut out the three inch um, printout. You're going to apply adhesive on the back, and then you're going to go ahead and put it into your bottle cap. And again, this is the three inch one. Now you're gonna go ahead, put it in and set that aside because you're gonna use that later. Now the tricky part, the one that's a little bit more time consuming is to actually decorate this little tree. This little tree is about two and a half inches tall and you can find them at um, 
craft stores. So you can look around, especially around the holidays. You'll usually find them in a bunch of three or four together. So what you're going to do to decorate this tree is you can use, you can see that we used one of our crystal star pins. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to carefully and gently insert the star pin into the top of the tree and down the back. Now you can see, you can actually see the pin on the back, but when you turn it around, the star looks perfectly fine at the top. Now you can also see in this bottle cap, I have a little snowflake at the bottom, kind of as a base for the tree. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my glue here, and I'm going to glue the tree onto a, one of our vintage snowflakes. So there you see, you can have a little tree. Now you can see here, as I'm decorating, I went ahead and found some self-adhesive pieces of bling. And I just applied those. And I use gold. You can choose whatever color you want. And I applied it to the tree in random locations. Go cooperate with me. I use some large ones and some small ones. Go ahead and use about eight of them so you kind of decorate the front of the tree. And you can see how the tree looks now. And the final touch is I actually cut the word Mary out from the printout for the two inch bottle cap. You can see that this is the two inch bottle cap printout. Here's the word Mary and I cut that out. And then I'm going to apply some glue to the bottle cap here. And I'm going to glue the word Mary down. And look at that, you have your little tree. Now to finish it off, you're going to go ahead and you're going to glue the little tree down in here. It might help, you might want to use either some foam dots in the back and maybe some uh, regular good old fashioned hot glue up here to help it stand inside and sit firmly. And when you're done, you have this beautiful three inch uh, tree ornament. So all you have to do is add some ribbon on the back to tie it on your tree or you can add a magnet and you can use it as a magnet for your fridge. See how easy and simple it is to make this? Thanks for joining us.